Thousands of demonstrators join banned pro-Palestinian march in Paris. Here's a summary of the article. Paris. Thousands of demonstrators protested in Paris on Saturday in a banned march in support of the Palestinian people, AFP correspondents saw. Among the protesters were elected officials wearing tricolor scarves, including a Green MP and a far-left lawmaker. The devastating conflict erupted after Hamas militants carried out a shock cross-border attack on Israel on October 7 that left 1,400 people dead, most of them civilians, according to Israeli officials. The Islamist group has also taken some 229 people to the Gaza Strip as captives, according to the army. In retaliatory Israeli strikes, more than 7,700 people have been killed in the Gaza Strip, including some 3,500 children, according to the territory's health ministry. Daily newsletter receive essential international news every morning. It is not right that a ceasefire has not been called, that thousands of civilians are dying and no one is saying anything, she said. This post received a score of 3,600, with an upvote ratio of 84%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. If you ban a demonstration, but don't enforce it, was it ever really banned? An outright ban was a mistake, especially in Paris. Parisian rioting season is a meme FFS, mitigation and containment should have been prioritized. Paris has had some issues with terrorism in recent years. This chain of removed is the funniest thing I've seen today. No, I don't have a life. Is Reddit on a troll hunt? Or perhaps it was the same, user? Usually it's someone who said something anti-Semitic and Reddit removed them. You'd be surprised the kind of words that will get your comment auto-removed. Banning the French from protesting. Yeah, that's not going to work. Are they French? About as French as me after I eat one escargot. Can't imagine why there's a rise in the far right across Europe. Where are the protests about this? Yes, of course, why won't the Paris government condemn Hamas? Civil action certainly is required to get him to say Hamas is bad. They must be protesting for the immediate and unconditional release of the hostages, right? No, they're claiming that celebrities who signed a letter asking that all hostages be released are evil and should be cancelled. Well, I'm on board with the releasing the hostages thing but I'm also on board with cancelling all celebrities too. Are they protesting the tunnels Hamas built under its civilian population, the hospitals and schools? No, those are decolonization freedom tunnels, s. Vive la resistance storage depots. Looks more anti-Israeli than pro-Palestinians by the signs. Not a single mention of Hamas, who is using two million people as human shields, or launching rockets from schools or kindergartens, or building a base below their hospital, or executing in cold blood whoever they think is a collaborator. You know, the day-to-day things that Hamas does. Even the signs mentioning Hamas managed to be anti-Israel. Source. And the signs calling for a ceasefire are clearly directed at Israel as well, not Hamas. Notoriously free speech supporting Redditors in favor of banning protests. Bunch of hypocrites. China must be thrilled to learn they got the Reddit seal of approval to ban all protests in Hong Kong and crack down on Uyghurs. It's all right because they were not pro-Israel enough. The Uyghur genocide was predicated on being a reaction to a brutal terrorist attack. Learning from Reddit that means it was okay. After all they were just defending themselves from mean Islamist separatists. In retaliatory Israeli strikes, more than 7,700 people have been killed in the Gaza Strip, including some 3,500 children, according to the territory's health ministry. 3,500 children out of 7,700? Edit. This is quite a damning read. This video was automatically created by Reddit to Speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.